Hey guys, welcome to Apple Tech once again. Today we are back with a smartwatch. Today I want to show you how to connect this smartwatch to your Android or iPhone. I've received a lot of questions about how to download uh, App Watch. So that's what I'm going to show you on both iPhone and uh, Android. So let's start with an iPhone. Uh, before that, this is not a Samsung watch or Apple watch. It's just this other brands of watches. So you can as well connect it on iPhone or on Android. However, you cannot receive all, all things that the uh, Apple watch can do. So let's go ahead and start with an iPhone. So what you need to do, you have to go into app settings from here. You scroll, you look for app download or what we call QR, QR code. For example, here you have to go here. This is app download. Once you open it, it will show you a QR code that you can use to scan with your with your an iPhone. The iPhone you can use a camera, open your camera, then you can directly scan this one. Let me search it again. So open it, use your camera, then you can scan and you touch on this. It will directly take you to this page where you will click on Apple Store. Once you click on Apple Store, it will directly show you an app download that you scanned from this watch. So this is it. This is the this is the app. You directly click on get, then you immediately you download it. If you can see from here, they are they are the same. They are the same. So put your password from here, then you download. Let me first. So after putting your password, you will immediately download this. So let's go and we go to an, an Android. So Android, what you need to do, make sure you have internet on this device. So on Android, most of the phones, they don't, they, they don't have QR code or they cannot scan. This is Samsung, it can direct a scan, but those who don't have Samsung, you have to go to Play Store, then you search for what we call Kiwala, Kiwala Scanner. So you can download this. Once you download it, then you can open it. Once you open it, Once you open it, do the same thing on this one. Go to go to settings, also open this. Then open your camera. Then scan for this. Scan, once you scan it, then it will show you this. Then click on this link here. So that's what that's what we do if you want to, to connect your app watch then after downloading the app you can as well go to this is the app now it has downloaded it has downloaded but before that you can go into the the bluetooth settings this is it then here click on google google app it will also show you the same application so install it then from here i have to down to connect using bluetooth here after it has connected then go back to this application make sure you allow all these things here 
then registration is free do registration on this account then also here you do the same thing you have to make sure you connect bluetooth first for the watch then now from here it has you, you can say it has connected but once you click on here on device here on device you can see that there is no there is no watch connected so what do you need you have to scan for the available watches If it denies on that one, just click on add. So you can see here it's giving us the guidelines what you need to do. Just go into the settings, connect IW7. So let's go into the settings. As you can see, it is connected, meaning that if you from here even if you receive any call you can directly receive it from here sometimes iphones they don't connect this side if you do pair it cannot connect it just stops there but for an android you can go ahead and connect all these things and control the music so let us remove iphone then we go to to android for android just open the app so that let's connect the Bluetooth. This is the W7 Pro. Let's connect this one below. Pair. It's now connected and showing also the battery is on 10%. Now, what do we need to do? What do we need to do from here? Uh, go back to this application, make sure you agree to all, then click on registration. So this is the brand for SZOS but on other watches it will show you different different uh, software but you have also to interact with it in the same way. So click on device as well, it will also show you that scan, allow. It is also showing valid, so click on add, pair, it is searching, now you see from here it has paired successful on this Android as I was telling you that on iPhone it, it cannot do all th these things but on this one it can do all, the, uh, on Android it can connect very well. As you can see the watch has been connected now you can receive the messages from this watch you can receive you know, calls you can pick because these watches they have a speaker on this side as a speaker so you can do receive calls and you can also do some some settings from this one um, you can see the location you can do um, also exercises and you receive all the um, then you can also do here dial can control the music as well from this side yeah on android it works very well with these watches which are not apple watches so guys if you have any other question you can as well go into this comments put your comment i can reply to you as soon as possible Thank you for watching, catch you in the next one.